Hello everyone, I'm MLive Chief Meteorologist Mark Torregrossa. You know, the winter was rough on us. I have a beehive. We're going to check to see how the bees did because last year we lost a lot of bees and a lot of honey here in Michigan. This is Vernon Arndt from uh, Bay City. He's been teaching me. Go ahead, Vern, uh, pull this off. And uh, Vern's already taken a look, but you can see there's about 50,000 bees in here. Last winter I lost this hive in the extreme cold. We had to buy all new bees and uh, Right now, what do you think, Vern? How do the bees look? These look real good. They're doing good. They've ate half of the feed off in two days. Okay, so they're hungry right now because there's no flowers out. So we've put this feeder on here, actually, and that's helping them make it through until the flowers start coming? Right. They need supplemental food this time of the year. The, when it's really cold, they use a lot of food. And last year, what percentage of beehives did, did we lose in Michigan? Oh, we lost 90% probably. Okay, this year, how are we faring? Right now, I'm at 75 percent that it survived. That survived. Okay, fantastic. So that means our bees are in good shape here in Michigan this year. That helps the fruit industry, all of the pollination that the bees do, and of course you love that honey I know in the store. Take a look at all the bees. They are ready to go to work this summer in my fruit trees and in my garden. And I gotta tell you something, I've been in this a couple years, it's a fascinating thing. If you're interested in bees, find a beekeeping association in your area, learn about this. It's the kind of the root of gardening because we need these guys here to get all of our food pollinated. So very important. Bees made it through, we made it through winter. All good news, right?